everyone today is worried about the trans fat content of foods these are considered bad facts what is the scientific truth behind these trans fats let us see in today's video hi friends i am dr karamat this is scientific doctor channel in this channel every week a health related topic is discussed via a video if you want to see such videos subscribe to this channel this week's video is about trans fats what are trans fats we know among fats there are saturated fats and unsaturated fats in unsaturated fats chemically if a double bond is hydrogenated in the trans position this is too chemical but anyway that is called as a trans fat it is a part of unsaturated fat but which is bad trans fats can be natural as well as artificial and not all trans fats are bad natural trans fats occur in dairy products non vegetarian foods like beef and lamb these are inherently not bad what is usually considered bad are artificial trans fats these are industrially produced from vegetable oils to make the vegetable oils shelf life longer and to make them solid at room temperature this hydrogenation is done this is what results in this trans fats so trans fats are present in foods like vanaspati or margarine so what is bad about trans fats so trans fats when ingested increase the ldl cholesterol which is called the bad cholesterol without an accompanying increase in hdl cholesterol or the good cholesterol usually whenever fatty foods are ingested you have an increase in ldl cholesterol as well as hdl cholesterol so both good and bad are increased so there is a balance when you eat foods rich in trans fat the ldl cholesterol rise but the hdl cholesterol doesn't rise that's what is bad about the trans fats so what are the health effects of eating foods rich in trans fats so there have been umpteen number of studies what has been proven is foods rich in trans fats if you eat them regularly they may result in an increased risk of cardiovascular diseases that is heart diseases they may increase the risk of obesity they may increase the risk of diabetes mellitus they may increase the risk of cancer certain cancers like breast cancer they may also have bad effects over pregnancy sometimes resulting in pregnancy induced hypertension they may predispose us to allergies so all these are bad health effects of trans fats as i said already not all trans fats are bad naturally occurring trans fats like what is there in breast milk so even your breast milk contains trans fats these are essential for life so what is to be avoided is that artificially manufactured trans fats so do trans fats occur elsewhere in processed foods when oil is used at high temperatures for frying especially when this oil is used for frying again what is called as refrying so in all these processes trans fats increase in the food so these processes need to be avoided so essentially we have to keep in mind that not all fats are bad so even when you say trans fat free in a processed food that just mean it contains less of trans fats and foods especially cooked in vanaspati or margarine when oils are used for frying especially refrying again and again at high temperatures which is what usually we indians do especially when you buy food from outside they may use the same oil for frying again and again we have to note that once fried this oil can be used for cooking but not again for frying so thereby by observing these simple measures and by avoiding processed foods you can get your diet to have low trans fats and thereby reducing its risk friends this would have cleared your doubts on trans fats if you like this video share it among your friends and relatives if you want to see such videos subscribe to this channel till we meet again bye